2K Sports, in association with the PGA Tour, proudly presents the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today's coverage of the Waste Management Phoenix Open is about to kick off. Pleased you could join us for this third round action. Luke Elby alongside Rich Beam. And Rich, this player's been playing some impressive golf. They've got the lead. They're where they want to be, but what should be their mindset going into this round? Well, hopefully it's not on the chasing pack because the chasing pack is filled with some big names. So they're going to have to really bear down, focus on the task at hand. They've got to sit there and keep their emotions to themselves and not get wrapped up in everybody else around them. Can't wait to see what unfolds. And let's see what he can do here today. Second shot here on the first. This is looking pretty good in the air. Oh, you beauty, an eagle. Fantastic touch. What a play indeed. What a shot. Let's go ahead and put the old stink eye on another one. Yeah, this was a gift. Wasn't expecting this. To that hole, this player is currently in first place, with Colin Morikawa close behind in second. We have a par four on this one. Coming off an eagle at the last, momentum on their side for this player. Good looking shot, this. for the second shot here on the second hole. Looks like they're going with the pitching wedge. All right, we're going with an extra club here. Yeah, nicely played. What's in front of them, Henny? Setting up this putt 18 feet from the cup. This is their look at birdie. You know you want to. Seems to be some sort of a mission he's on today. Setting the tone early in this round. Currently in first position. And coming off the birdie, they'll be proud of themselves, a chance to keep it rolling. That should find the cut stuff. <laughs> Playing this shot from about 210 yards out. Opting for the hybrid, I think. This is bold. Going for it in two. Well, that's a tremendous shot and sets up a wonderful opportunity. 
using the big muscles to get it home in two there. Oh, well, you set yourself up with an eagle opportunity. Go to your home ball. Go to your home. And that putt will drop, and he'll extend his lead. Just the start they were looking for, Luke. No movement up or down on the leaderboard for this player. T is yours. Here we are at the fourth hole. Feeling awfully good coming off an eagle at the last. Opting for the five iron. A sensational shot and a chance for a birdie here on the four. And just about eight feet left to the hole. That's tracking. Well played. Got to say, putting this well from this distance is a huge confidence booster. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. This has to be one of the more difficult holes in golf. The long par four. That was absolutely murdered. And what are we looking at here, Henny? And from around 135 yards, over 300 yards from the tee as well. That's pretty solid. Chosen the pitching wedge here. Trying to get it to move a little bit to the left here. That's just inside the range. And this one for back-to-back -back birdies. Fourteen feet to the cup. Looking for another birdie here. This one's online. Gets that one to go down, and that's back-to-back -back birdies. Kind of like it. Two in a row. Well, with that good play, this person is now in first on the leaderboard, with Colin Morikawa right behind them. The play so far has been stellar, increasing the lead, Luke. But can they maintain it? Let's find out. And what's in front of them there, Henny? And from about 105 yards, he really got that one out there. Fantastic drive. Yeah, that one's looking good. Great ball striking. It's a thing of beauty. Well, the practice is paying off here, Luke. This player is relentless. Looking really good, this one. 
And with that, that's their fourth birdie. He sits in first position. Deep into the front nine, here we are at the seventh hole. Well, that'll be one of the shots of the day, that's for sure. Well, take notes, folks. That's how you do it. This putt coming up is for birdie. Hang on, this looks pretty handy. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. We've reached the eighth hole. The tee is yours. Wow, that was just striped. <laughs> Playing from around 110 yards out. Choosing the 9-iron nine -nine here. How close was that to going in the hole? Great shot. Wow. Showing Will Zalatoris that this rivalry is indeed not to be taken lightly. A birdie putter waits. Gee, that's good playing. Six birdies in a round. And staying right where they were in today's rankings after that. And they'd be feeling buoyed with confidence after that birdie. There's a good chance to maintain the momentum. This looks to be a fairway seeker to me. And Henny, what are you seeing down there? Setting up from about 130 yards out. Had a fantastic drive. Going with the eight iron here. This looks to be hit pretty well from where I'm standing. Not a bad shot, that. Still a chance. 13 feet to the cup. What a great opportunity here for a look at a birdie. That was a gallant attempt. And that should secure the par on this one. After that hole, this player is currently in first place, with Colin Morikawa close behind in second. Here we go, the tenth hole. What a drive, look at that.
club up. I like this play. Got to admire that talent. Just green after green in regulation. Another green in regulation. This is an absolute clinic. A chance for a booty if this goes down. Short game has been especially sharp today, Luke. Very impressive. And another one goes. And with it, an increase of his lead. And this is quality play, still on top of the leaderboard. And now teeing off on this par four hole. Second shot here on the 11th. Looks to have opted for the eight iron. Oh, look at this, right down the throat. Oh, he's trying to silence the young buck, Will Zalatoris, with that one really putting his cards out on the table brilliant stuff oh, a nine foot chance here all right guys this for two birdies in a row looks good and that's eight birdies today two in a row there luke getting their groove on and now that finds him in first place Here we are, in front of a par three. <laughs> Looks to have chosen the seven iron. A wonderful shot and a birdie opportunity coming up at the 12th. If it's up, it could be in. Oh, how about that one? Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard after that effort. And they'd be feeling buoyed with confidence after that birdie. Here's a good chance to maintain the momentum. Absolutely tattooed that one. They've had a chat with the caddy and they're going for it. This one's on. going with the hybrid that was a beauty putting for eagle here Always well, nice to have a birdie putt. Well, with that good play, this person is now in first on the leaderboard.
with Colin Morikawa right behind them. Quite often the hardest hole in golf, a long par four. Nicely done. And he's down there. I'd say he's about 165 from this flag. What a drive that was. F1, watch out. Going with the seven. Well struck. And this putt is for birdie three on the scorecard. Looking really good, this one. A bit too much pace on that one. This part of about seven feet to the hole. Ooh, nice line. That gets the job done. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. Let's see what happens here on the 15th. <laughs> oh, that's piped. That's heading down the runway. I don't know about you, Rich, but I love this 15th hole at TPC at Scottsdale. Everyone's already focused on getting into the stadium hole. But this one here, wow, what a shot you got in front of you. I'm laying up eight days a week and hitting wedge in there close for my third, Luke. No chance I'm taking on this second shot. Oh, no, is that heading towards the bunker? A chance now from the bunker for an up and down. You can reach for the putter because that one's on the surface. Didn't quite get the approach close enough, so a long putt in front of them. Little birdie look in here. No, that's too bad. I think they gave that one too much respect. They didn't want to hit it too hard and go racing past the hole. That's a good putt for par. You'll take it. Currently in first position. We have a par three on this one. Opting for the six iron. You don't need 
much to fire up this crowd, but that one will get them on their feet. Oh, this will be good for the momentum. Let's make this birdie putt. And down it goes. Up to that hole, this player is currently in first place with Colin Morikawa close behind in second. Oh, and they increase their lead. This is impressive, Luke, but can they hold up this play? Oh, that was a boss move off that tee. Found the green in one shot. And he's down there. You got a read? Yeah, they've left it in the perfect spot here, just below the hole. They can be aggressive up the hill. Oh, so close. Always love these opportunities, especially when it's for birdie. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. Pretty sure this player will be buoyed by that birdie back at the last. Let's see if they can deliver another one. That looks to be a fairway finder to me. This shot from 120 yards. Mm. That's right out of the copy books. Exquisite. That's just about three feet away. And another round safely in the books. Through 54 holes, this wonderful golf continues. Our leader in the clubhouse. Always good to be out in first place. That means you can afford to make a mistake tomorrow, but you don't want to make too many of them with the chasing back and lurking behind. On behalf of myself, Rich Beam, and all the hardworking folks at 2K Sports, thanks for tuning in and see you next time.